Dang, boys, well, here we go. This is, what is this, like a Mars rover type situation? What the? F so it's a, it's a four-wheeler, right? Let's just start by saying it's a Raven. That's what they call them. It's a four-wheeler. It also has a 7,100 watt generator on board. to go ham on them david got these daggum 20 amp hour duracells and uh whoo better watch that now boy yeah. all right well here we go dudes let's see if we can get these raven mpvs ripping okay. is it the duracell no it's the, which damn duracell don't even have a mascot does it i don't think so no uh, you gotta get the energizer it's that sex bunny yeah yeah theirs was too rated r but we've got four of these badass four batteries and we're gonna swap out these and see if we can get these ravens working i'll go get y'all a video man hold up i bought these pile of shits delivered the other day 600 bucks for the pair if you don't know what you see here what you basically got it is like a 12 horsepower motor, a 7,100 watt generator. They sell an optional mower deck for them. And then you've got your utility bed in your golf cart style. So they'll run 20 miles an hour. They'll cut grass if you have the deck. They'll put out 7,100 watts. I've tested both generators. Both machines fire up. Both generators work. Like I run a heat gun and a couple other like high, high uh, draw tools off of them they all work so we've got the battery core off of that one inside and we're going to make sure we can get her working if it does we're going to test on this one if that works and we'll just get four more batteries boys i'm gonna keep one sell one and sell my other generator pretty cool machine pretty neat machine it's hybrid so it sucks that's the only bad part it won't run off the gas engine the gas engine starts up but it just generates electricity to charge the batteries the machine runs off the battery so in hybrid mode you switch this key you switch the key to battery only and then you're running all electric and then if you want to start up the engine it'll charge the batteries while you go so it's hybrid but has to run off the batteries that's how a hybrid system works it isn't you just pick and choose this runs off the batteries the gas engine charges the batteries and since i had to buy the batteries i get one set of four test them on both machines those are 100 bucks a piece so I don't want to buy eight batteries. I have this perk down at the batteries plus. Tell me he's not going to take them back. So <clears throat> you get one set. You test it on both machines. And then we'll, time will tell whether or not I buy four more batteries. I'm not all, I'm not all sure Clayton knows what he's doing per se. But you want to get these out of here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, make sure to cut to the battery. Yeah, it's real good for electricity. Yeah. It's super low. You want an extension, bro, for that? Nah, that's new. Okay. You loosener, then I'll finger fuck it. Oh, okay. That's how you loosen her, isn't it? Oh, never mind. Yeah. I like this one the best. Yeah, yeah. It's close quality. It's high quality. High quality. <laughs> yeah, I know. I was like, what? The guy asked me, what year model are the machines? I was like, I think they're 2018s. And I looked at the batteries. I was like, well, maybe they're 2014s. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't remember. You gotta use your context clues. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember. So we don't have to put that back on. <laughs> yeah. Or we can, but if we just cut off these top pieces, that'd be perfect time. Huh? And were they taped together? Yeah, they're all taped together. Watch your feet, dog. Huh? Um, if you want, you just set them out there in the grass. All right, that's about, huh? that's about that's a $50 bill. Uh, oh, it's gonna be all jiggity janked. How did they end up longer? Let's get the grinder. Um, what, what do you think? Grind the battery or the bracket? Or... Hold on, let me... I wonder if those mothers would go in all sideways. <laughs> like this? Yeah. We'd probably just wire them up so fucked if we did it. <laughs> I mean, it would work. If we did it the other way? As long as it ain't too wide. You know what is the battery? Shit, man. Oh, but then the... Oh, yeah, they wouldn't be close enough. Oh. Huh? oh. Yeah. No, because then it'll have to have a big jump. Yeah. Oh, a long cable, and that'll we'll lose some hair. All right, well. Well, I mean, we probably got enough. 
Yeah. Oh, I have plenty of cable. I just got these old jumper cables. Look, this is going to be easy. You don't even have to. If we really wanted to just <laughs> sleep them all together, they got pigtails on them. I think we can make it work with the uh, way we had it. What we might do, man, is there something we can put under it to raise them all up? Yeah, but if we do, then this bracket won't work right. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. So I'm thinking about just cutting these off, the tops, because honestly, from what we were looking at with the battery earlier, or me and the guy at the place, this was a, just a hair taller than those, but I don't know for sure. Yeah, well, we could always just bend them. Yeah, we could do that. Oh, yeah, just bend them up a little bit. Well, I guess we'll do that, man. It doesn't really matter if they're, they're sealed. So they're not going to leak or nothing. Yeah. yeah. Though, take, you got to lay this just so that... <laughs> Yeah. So that we know it works. Here's a little brown. Piece. So we had to get all nasty with it in front of us. If you want, man, considering I made they made the thing may be no good. You want to just carry it out there like that and see if it works? Yeah, it'll probably stay. Yeah. Making it real legit. Yeah. Okay. Can you carry it? I got the rest. I got number five right here. Oh. We busted the micro 5000 watts uh, amp the bus busted the, bu the 300 buster fuse for sure we yeah. could just skip that fuse can't we and just go hard wire uh, i mean it's the easiest way to find out where your short is you'll just smoke <laughs> whatever wires fucked up so. this should be good Well, no, you hook it up, and then you just plug the wires into the thing. You can see it. Pop it in. We're going to pull that one off and see if we can put another one onto the, uh, from the other one. Well, boys, this old hunk of crap, actually, it moved forward, it lurched forward a little bit. Lurched, heavy on the lurch. I wonder if you had anything to do with it. I don't know. We'll see. I think this gets held down by that dog. Yeah. Well, the problem is... It's already too bent. Yeah. It, like, we got to bend it up to be able to clear the bracket since we are using the little Since we fudged it. Yeah. So, we got another one back there. What was that? A 100 amp fuse. Yeah. She was grenaded. And, uh... Well, and then we just kind of fiddled with this key switch. <laughs> and we fiddled it from hybrid to battery and back and forth a few times and then it all of a sudden it worked. You know what probably is going to happen? When you're driving it's just going to fucking wiggle loose and die. Probably. I was thinking though it's just going to drive till the batteries die and the fucking probably the charging system don't work. Yeah. Yeah I think it was in high gear. Is he... Try and give it some gas, see what happens. Maybe you gotta start it first, huh? Is it gonna be a neutral or something? Surely that battery's getting it. Now, try driving it. This is weird, now it's gonna start driving, so be ready. There you go. Once you get turned, damn, how many horsepowers is that? We're not supposed to run them bad boys indoors. We're gonna die. Shit! Oh, all that torque. I got her in high now, boy. All right, put her in forward. Get it to roll. Like right, drive it first, so we know. Okay, now turn it to electric. Won't go in electric. 
I think like we we're saying, I think this portion of the switch, keep trying to move, hold, you hold the pedal down? Just hold it down. Weird. I bet. Oh, you know what? Hold up. Hold up. Does this come with this? There you go. Oh, look, you can see the whole thing right behind it. Oh, you can see all the wires right here. Damn, we can clean it right there, dude. Able to just reach in there and unplug the pigtail and see if that's where the corrosion is. But if not, then we can do the tumblers and the two together afterwards. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So we should be able to jump them together. Now she won't even crank. Yeah. Uh, it's just that damn switch. So drive, boys. Oh, yeah. Oh, there she goes. She just take a second. It was working fine until you hopped on it, started dogging on it. You know, just weird electrical shit. Yeah. So we got this done, and this. This is me dragging my feet on this, because it's pissing me off. Generates real good. But you know, that's what happens when you got a generator, ATV, you know, lawn mower combo. Shit. Yeah. You got too much shit piled on shit. Yeah. I know they all sit in the side. I got some videos earlier where I totally wrote it. Yeah, for sure. He wonders why I'm hard on it when I got the chance. <laughs> like, that was honestly going easy. Yeah, all right. works perfectly uh, I believe either this switch or this switch has gone bad on me boys I don't know which one check this out if I switch it to hybrid and turn it back it'll run it's got brand new batteries but as soon as I let off the, off the pedal it stops again so let's see there we go now when I let off the gas that's all she wrote. I don't want to wreck the subject. It's going pretty good. Yeah, yeah. So, as you can see, the transmission works. It's just... It needs some work with the electrical. I don't know what. 